leaving Akhalsik or something along those lines. A bit of a busy, busy road here. Hope I'll get off from it soonish. It's full blown summer out here. This is the first morning when I don't feel like moving at all. Ten days in a row. Every day packing up the camp, hitting the bicycle and moving as soon as possible. But now I'm really tired and not feeling well. <sighs> Rough morning. <laughs> Tough day. I've been on the move for one and a half hours and moved for uh, 5.4 kilometers. It's headwind. I'm seriously bonking but can't eat anything for some weird reason. I don't feel like eating and I know I should eat. well at all. Don't know what's going on with me. Oh. Today I hit the wall. I was up there in the valley. I was running out of water. There was none available because it was on top of a 2,000 meter mountain. And then I just collapsed. Luckily I found this really nice guest house got a room. I'll have a good night's sleep here tonight. See how I feel, how I feel tomorrow. Leaving Varchia after a rest day, I was feeling really sick. My phone died. And uh, what else? Well, it was not a good day in any way. That thing back there is Pachi. Now I'm climbing this 500 meter ascent somewhere up there. Finally at the top. Have to stop in the next town for some cash running a bit low and uh, these small villages in the mountains don't accept credit card. Everybody has haystacks on their yards. Somehow managed to get lost again. myself a nice hotel 45 kilometers from here two hours of daylight left I better hurry I was pondering camping out but still not feeling perfect so decided to opt for a hotel plus I found a really nice one
last full day of riding. Was planning to head up the mountains and uh, camp out there for the night, but then check the weather forecast and uh, don't want to put my rain gear on for the uphill unless it really rains, because it gets really hot. Sounds like we got some thunder too. It's gonna be fun. I'm so gonna have my lunch at that bus stop. Today's game plan is starting to look a lot like straight to the police. Don't really fancy camping out there with thunder and all. If there's a warm and dry hotel room available in Tbilisi. Let's see, I'll keep cycling and keep an eye on the weather. There's like a huge wind from the side. Cycling all sideways. It's 40 kilometers to Tbilisi, and I just made a booking for a hotel. My last day of cycling today. About 25 kilometers to go. I have a chance to make it before nightfall. That down there is the edge of Tbilisi. A lot of downhill to go. Uh, next up, surviving Tbilisi traffic. <laughs> Back where I started from more than two weeks ago. It's done. Oh, and when I got back to the hotel yesterday evening, the hotel owner saw my biking shoes, or I think he smelled them, and asked if I had any other shoes with me, which I didn't. So, so he asked for my shoe size and uh, borrowed me his own. 